know, Chris, Chris yeah. is being believable. I think people in general, too, because the book really talks about perseverance. It talks I about think, think faith and, and just kind of, you know, picking yourself up when you're knocked down. So that's, I think that's everybody's story to some degree and really yeah. trying to attain something that you see in front of you. And no matter what, um, still pushing forward. And then also love, you know, because he's got this love interest, but he meets a new woman, too, and he's kind of interested in her. So you really don't know where Ziv is going to go, and the book has had so many twists and turns in it. Uh, people just, like, when they're, and I even had a young lady who hit me up on Twitter today. She was like, you know, I loved your book. I reviewed it. I loved it. But my son, my 13-year-old son read it, and he was like, Mom, this is like the Christian version of uh, Percy Jackson. Yeah. When is the next one coming out? I'm like, well, I just dropped this one. <laughs> <laughs> it'll, be, it'll be next year, though, uh, willing, you know. So, yeah. Yeah. so tell me again how to get it. You can go on Amazon and then uh, look for the School of Ministry, or you can go to the website, schoolofministry.com. The School of Ministry? The School of Ministry.com. Or you can actually go to my website, braxtoncosby.com. Braxtoncosby.com. Now, you're a busy man. Yeah. You're a father of three girls, yeah. and you've got uh, a wonderful wife, and you're a physical therapist. Yeah. You're a sports nutritionist. Sports nutritionist. <laughs> so, sports yeah, trainer. tell me about, uh, you do some work in radio also. Yes, uh, there's a radio show we do called Ask the Fat Doctors, and it talks about, it's a mashup between um, health and current events. So we always try to see what's out there. We talk about current events for a little bit on the segment, and we also talk about health. We'll have other doctors come on, guests that we talk to just about obesity, the, you know, the fight against obesity and diabetes. And... Um, just all these uh, the secondary diseases of excess weight. And it's just been something on my heart that I wanted to do to really help people just to kind of unlock things. You know, I have a, a blog also called Cosby's Corner where I really talk about nutrition and, and health, and I use all the tools and education that I have to kind of educate people like, hey, you know, there's great things like protein and, and, and there's peanuts. You know, what does what the, the power of the peanut have? You know, you can find it on my blog site. You know, what about Africa? What about all these things we kind of shy away from? And, um, and I really just want people to kind of just embrace taking care of themselves and, and really being serious about their health. And, I'm, and that's from the smallest to the oldest. Yeah. I think we really, we have the ability to do it. We just have to tap into that. And education is the key first um, because people get into all these convoluted and, and, and really intricate diets. And then what they do is they fall off. They try the first day. Or maybe you do one of those great exercise things out there. Yeah. You hurt the next day, you're done. You know, so... I actually came up with a campaign called Eat Less, Move More. And I tried to make it simple. I said, hey, whatever your plate size is, why don't you eat half of that, eat less, and then you move more. Whatever you did, the activity, why don't you double it? So if you take a pedometer and you walked 1,000 steps one day, why don't you try to do 2,000 next day? Just make it very simple and let your mind and your body acclimate to the adjustment. And then as you get better and you really kind of buy into it, then try some of those more difficult things. That way you're not so discouraged. Okay. Yeah. And now when can we hear this radio program? Uh, it come, It's on 1380 WADOK, okay. and the show uh, airs every Saturday morning at 8 o'clock. Saturday morning, 8, 8 o'clock, WADOK, 1380 AM. And, you, and uh, you have guests on there to talk yeah. about that? Yeah, we have, we have a few guests. Um, we have some doctors that we work with. Uh, one of the head um, doctors at um, Howard University, bariatric surgeon. We have him on. Uh, I co-host a show with Jamie Dukes from the uh, NFL Network, yeah. retired Atlanta Falcons player, yeah. uh, and another young lady named T. Fox. She's been in radio for years. So, yeah, we just have a good time, and we have a fitness instructor who's fantastic named Carla Fields as well. So. Well, I'm excited to know that, because um, you see this more and more in the church, you know, we're...